Hey, what's up? This is Rob from Panther and today we're going to check it out how to make this kinetic typo in After Effects. Step one, we're going to make a new composition. Let's click on the new composition. I'm going to rename it as text. I'm going to click OK and I'm going to type in some text. Select the type tool, click. I'm going to go with Panther Vision. Press and hold control, double click on the band behind. So it's gonna position the anchor point into the center. Click on the align, align it to the center. Go to composition, composition settings. And here we are going to adjust the height. We're basically gonna decrease the height until it's gonna go fit perfectly their text. Some like this, click okay. I'm gonna press the letter S for scale. I'm gonna scale it up a little bit more and decrease it a little bit more there you go click ok now we're gonna go to the project right click click on new composition we're gonna rename this as final comp and we're gonna make the height 1920 and the width 1080 click ok i'm gonna drag in the text into the final composition i also gonna scale this down something like this i gotta go to the effects and presets type in repeat tile and drag on to the text we're gonna increase the extend down and also we're gonna increase the up I'm going to leave it like this so far and I'm going to go and type into the search cylinder. Drag and drop on the text. As you can see, it made a cylinder out of it. Let me go to the position and I'm going to rotate the X 90 degrees. So let's see what we can do from here. I also going to adjust from the repeat tile, the expand the left. So as you can see, if I increase the repeat tile, then it's going to make more and more copies of the text. Press the letter S for scale. I'm going to scale it up. So I'm going to make it fit. We're going to need to randomize this pattern because it's a little bit boring. So I'm going to go to the tiling and we're going to go with brick. And this is eventually is going to mix up pretty nicely. Of course, we got some errors in here, but we can increase or decrease in order to fix it. Oh, there you go. And now we're going to animate it. I'm going to press and hold Alt and I'm going to click on the rotation Y. And we're going to type in here time asterisk. And we're going to type in the number like how fast you want to go. And I'm going to go with 40. And it's alive. You can customize it however you like. I'm going to go all the way down. Check this out. Wow, look at this guys. I just made it like super duper wide. Basically, I decreased it to 16. So I stretched it out by a lot. And here you can see it's spinning. And yeah, this was it. Thanks for watching. And if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates. And also check out the rest of the videos at the end. Have a good one. Bye bye.